Jay? Mm. Zach Bailey, man. Good to meet you. Big fan. Oh, right. Sorry, man. I just... I... What? <laughs> Expecting someone who shaves? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I know. Well, my mom says that I'll appreciate the baby face later, but right now I'm still single and getting carted at movie theaters, so I'm working on that James Harden thing, you know? So, uh... Pre-draft. Anxious? Yeah, but you know what? It's time. Fair enough. Damn right. Well, I'm just gonna be level with you. Uh, the NBA execs are a little anxious about your decision to stay in school, and you couple that with your demonstration, and let's just say taking a flyer on an unproven 18-year-old starts to look a little bit more appealing. What happens to drafting someone who's, you know, mature? Who can actually come in and contribute? Yeah, fair enough. But look, in this racket, potential will always reign supreme. But don't worry about it. We still got a chance, okay? I'm just trying to let you in on the perception that's out there. But I, uh, <clears throat> I do want to pick your ear about your little situation with the, your advisor. Who, Issa? Yeah. Oh, she just helped me out. I trust Issa. Okay. Well, did she have anything to do with your decision to stay in school or to sit out that game? What are you getting at? <laughs> All I'm saying is, if you and I want to try and make it into the league, I can't have anyone else in your ear. Okay, so what do I tell her? Well, Che, you're a professional now. You say thank you and goodbye. I gotta go. I'm double parked in a handicap. Flight leaves at four. They put the players up in the Renaissance, but... I've got a cousin in Virginia Beach, so I'm good. Jay, you good? Yeah. Issa. I, uh, I met with an agent back home. That's good. You like them? Yeah. I mean, he's legit. He reps some real dudes. You want me to follow up? Nah, you know, it's not necessary. He said, look, I, uh, I appreciate everything you've done for me. You know that. But I think I'm cool now, East. You know, I don't want you wasting your time. Oh. All right. You're not mad, right? Of course not. I, I, I won't lie. You know, I was excited to dip my toe in, you know. So are you sure this agent knows what he has in you? I mean, you're so much more than basketball. Yeah, he knows, most definitely. All right, then. Hey, Che, promise me one thing. You won't ever bend. You hear me? Hey. Hey, Okay, so let's talk strategy. Mm. Don't ever think the testing. Consider it a dry run for the NBA's official combine in Chicago. And that is the goal this week, okay? Get that invite. Cool. Excuse me, Che. Yeah. Um, could I get your autograph? Oh, uh, sure. What's your name, kid? Tony. Tony. Hey, Tony, who's your favorite player? Uh, Spider Mitchell? Oh, that's some scary talent right there. Spider is a beast. Yeah, but he's not revolutionary like my guy here. <laughs> Remember that. Cool. Thanks. You're welcome, kid. Donovan Mitchell? The new D-Wade? 
Yeah, reach for the stars, land on the moon. Where is that waitress? I'm about to go ape in this yacht review. Decent, but numbers are overrated anyway. I mean, KD couldn't bench 185 once. You think he's losing sleep over it? Actually, he may be, but he's a different type of cat, though. You know. Look, Che, if you want this combine nod, you're gonna have to perform in these scrimmages. Stay within yourself, but be vocal. We're selling you as a locker room guy, yeah? Yeah, cool. Hey, what did the left eye say to the right eye? What? Between you and me, something smells. <laughs> huh? <clears throat> Isn't that stupid? Yeah, this is pretty bad, yeah. I know, I didn't. I just look. Tim Duncan used to have his strength coach tell him a joke before every game, you know, keep him loose. Just relax, Jay, and leave it all out there on the wood. Gotcha. Another day on the wood, boss. How you gotta look at it? Yeah, man. Maybe for you. How many scouts you think made out to Montana to check on me, huh? Don't listen to him, Jonas. Che ain't got no worries. This don't pan out. Adam Silver will probably mention him himself. Poster boy for principal. <laughs> That's funny, Onyx. Well, I'd rather be the boy getting posted if it means I'm making a squad, you feel me? What's up, fellas? Hey. Whoa, what's up? Scotty what's up, man? Yeah, a lot of history in this locker room, man. Yeah, check this out. Take a look at this. You know, I'm from Arkansas. Youngest of 12. My dad worked in a mill. Nothing special about the way we grew up. Just poor folks. Sure some of you guys can relate to that, right? Yeah. You know, coming out of high school, I was only 6'1". 150 pounds. Wet. I only received one offer. Central Arkansas, and that was to be the team manager. <laughs> but something happened. Between my freshman and my junior year, I caught inches. Yeah, I was 6'7", and starting to feast on cats. But this ain't no Duke. This Central Arkansas. My coach is going crazy, going broke, calling all over, trying to get scouts just to come check me. But my senior year, a man named Marty Blake. Marty was known as the super scout for the NBA. He's helped out a lot of people like myself, John Stockton, Ben Wallace. He got us each into the Portsmouth invite, which changed our lives. If you want it bad enough, if you're willing to sacrifice, it will find you. I got six of those to prove it. Alright, 
My bad, my bad, Green. My bad, Green. Not gonna lie, a little bit ball. My bad, Big Up. Out there. Out there, he still got the ball. He's smart, Like, like.
up, little boy. Get up, little boy. Get him off me. Get him off me. You know you can't hold this. I'm gonna have to switch somebody. Good job. Go ahead, dunk that. Boom that. Hey, get off, you know. Your thing. Get to that drive. Combine, baby. Go Lockdown. Dunk that! Go ahead and go crazy. Pass my back. Uh, 